Hello students, our topic for today is Guided Composition. What is Guided Composition? Guided Composition is a short composition given in the form of an incomplete paragraph. So you must be wondering that how to complete the paragraph. All you need to do is complete the paragraph with the help of given notes or information. Don't forget to use the suitable helping verbs, conjunctions, prepositions, articles and correct punctuations. You must be thinking that are you allowed to use your own words to complete the paragraph? My answer would be that you can't add any information on your own. You just have to use the given clues in the box. You must be wondering how guided composition is going to help you. Well, let me tell you, the skill of writing can be developed to a great extent through guided composition. It encourages you to express your ideas clearly. Now let us understand this better with the help of an example. You have to complete a paragraph with the help of given notes. The notes are pyramids built for pharaohs. 2700 and 1600 BC, Egyptian belief, human spirit immortal, returns, well-preserved body after death. These are your notes. Now let us look at the paragraph. The paragraph reads, Pyramids dash for most of Egypt's great pharaohs. Dash, the people in ancient Egypt believed that the human dash and that it would return dash. Now you have to fill up A, B, C, D with the help of the notes that were given in the box. Now let us try to complete the paragraph with the help of given notes in the box. Pyramids were built for most of Egypt's great pharaohs between 2700 and 1600 BC. The people in ancient Egypt believed that the human spirit is immortal and that it would return to a well-preserved body after death. Well, students, you must have noticed that I have used some conjunctions, articles, prepositions, or helping words to complete the sentences that were given in the class. You have to do exactly the same thing. In part A, you have to add word to build. In part B, you have to add the preposition between. In part C, you have to complete the sentence with the help of a helping word. Spirit is immortal. And in part D, you have to add a suitable preposition to and article a. That would complete your entire paragraph and would make the entire composition beautiful. Students, I hope you have learned how to write a guided composition with a given example. Remember, you have to check whether your composition has swag, where S stands for suitable parts of speech. When I say parts of speech, it means suitable conjunction, articles, prepositions and helping verbs, where W stands for without additional information. You can't add anything on your own, remember? A here stands for accurate spellings 
and G stands for given proper punctuation. So you have learned that without a swag, your guided composition would not be meaningful. So I hope children that you have learned how to write a guided composition with the help of this example. Thank you.